Right, uh, welcome back. Uh, the Design Indava is calling for young creatives to submit applications to stand a chance to participate at their conference, which will take place uh, in Cape Town as well as the Johannesburg uh, Summercast venue in February 2020. Selected participants will get to meet leaders in the local and international design space and uh, will also have their work shown to both local and prominent international media as well as local uh, public. Now, closing date for submission for uh, the Emerging Creatives Program is on the 30th of October. And for more on this, we're joined from a C-Point studio by Neo Maditla, the Partnerships Manager for Design in Daba. Neo, very good morning and a warm welcome to Morning Live. Morning. Thanks for having me. Now, those selected to participate, when will they know that they've been chosen and uh, is there enough time for them to prepare? Yes, so um, this is the last week for people to apply for the Emerging Creatives Program. So, they still like our application process is not that complicated we just have an online form on our website and then they would need to just be like if you're designing fashion or products or you're a graphic designer or an architecture student or a graduate or you're just someone who's also like self-taught please go to our website and apply and then after the 30th then we go into a curation process where together with our curators who are helping us choose the last 50. Um, we go through all the entries and so they should know before the end of the year if they've made it and then that gives them enough time to start thinking about you know what they want the exhibition to look like, what's going to be in the stalls and then if they may be like creating products you have enough time to like actually make the products um, for your exhibition in February. Okay and those who participated in the previous project so uh, what kind of support uh, do you perhaps provide for them to sustain what they benefited through the project? Yeah so basically um, throughout the well what, when they we, when they are at Design and Double we have workshops for them where we kind of bring in either like other former emerging creatives who talk about their experiences but also we bring in like experts who kind of like help them in terms of like building their brand and you know what are the things that they need to know um, and then as part of that process I think a lot of the young people also just get to I guess get to meet other creatives and you know because sometimes it's like something that you are struggling with or something that another young person is struggling with and so it's also like a nice space for creatives to talk about themselves about the issues that they have and then with on our side whenever we are able to have like other opportunities for them beyond the program then we also like you know, call them back um, to participate in some of the programs we have. You just mentioned brand building, and at, uh, I suppose that's a very critical mm -hmm. facet of, uh, you know, the whole uh, uh, project. And do you want to talk to us about the details of this project, what it entails, and uh, sp especially for those that will be selected to participate? Yeah, so, I mean, for those who are selected to participate, it's, it's quite an intense week because, you know, you come to Cape Town and you get to exhibit your work for the whole week. Um, and within that, you have to actually tell people about what your work is. And I don't think people think about it enough because you are talking to other designers, you are talking to potentially someone who could stock your products, you are talking to, you know, someone who might actually like collaborate with you. And most times you are also speaking to people who would have come down to Cape Town to speak at our conference, you know, so it's like that, that for a lot of people is the first time that you actually get to speak about your brand um and crystallize what it is that you're actually doing yeah and uh, for those who want to participate in this project uh, what do they need to submit take us through the processes yes so you basically need to be between the age of 18 and 35 you need to be a design um, graduate or you would have graduated within the last two years if you are self-taught you can still apply for the program um, you need to be a South African citizen because we collaborate with the Department of Sports, Arts and Culture on this and the program itself is a way of kind of stimulating the design industry in the country um, and that's about it in terms of the criteria. The form itself you kind of need to um, go into a lot more detail about like you know who you are, where you're based, what you're trying to do with your business um, and so on. Great initiative the, that is uh, now and I mean it allows us to take a moment to reflect on how we could do things a little different but and thank you so much for your time much appreciated.
Well, that was uh, Neo Madita, me. the content strategist for the Design Indaba website, talking to us about the space for 50 